Sports. It's in the game. Till I make me a thousand Why you kick your fence, pull house around you Sounded good to me If you round with it I killed the demons We hit the ground running My stress gon' need a vest round the chest Reshape my world It's seven days or less On the chase like the day's chase Ice cream trucks Got us moving fast But it's never enough Yeah, I know that the weather is rough But it won't stop us Yeah, it's never enough well, the weather forecaster has promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And everyone here on Tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason, it's Belgium versus the Netherlands. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And with that, the attack fizzles out. The starting players for Belgium. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Yuri Tiedemann's plays alongside Axel Witzel in central midfield. And handed the task of playing up front today, Romelu Lukaku. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Nathan Ake in central defence. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset Frankie de Jong now what can they do from here and options in the centre and he knows he must thump it away that's useful play Preferring to go infield. Gives it a go. And no way through. Denied once more. Bertongen. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Let's take another look. It's a really well-timed pass to break the offside line. And then the finish from Lukaku demonstrates his ability to make the right run at the right time. What a good goal. One nil then. Frankie de Jong. Good tackle. De Jong. And the pie on the ball. Well read to put an end to that attack. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Now just the tackle that was needed. De Bruyne. Now options are plenty. Can't miss, surely! And the flag has gone up. Well, he has to work a lot harder to stay onside there. He didn't read the situation at all. The pie and Blint and the pie on the ball. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Tielemans. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think.
What a shocking pass, really. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. De Jong. Belgium recovering possession well. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Good technique displayed. The referee knew he's in with a chance. He went for placement, but not to be. Well, that's a big miss. 1v1 against the keeper, and he's missed the target. Carrasco. Intelligent threaded pass here. Quite possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. And you've got to say meat and drink to those in the wall. Well, potentially a chance for Belgium to extend their advantage from this corner. Well, still an issue here. De Bruyne. Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. When you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Gakpo and that is going to be a free kick can they put it away remarkable save yes again inspirational well as you can see Belgium haven't enjoyed the majority of possession so far but when they have won it back in midfield areas their counter-attacking has been excellent they'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment Yes, and maybe another break brewing here. Well, they keep the ball moving. Azar. Here's Carrasco. And whipped into the box. Well, not cleared away completely. And in the end, no damage done. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Almost at half-time, and they're making home advantage count, I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, from an attacking point of view, it's been a very good performance. I've really liked the way they've got the ball from back to front, then how the forwards have got away from their markers, and the speed of their attacks as well. It's been a really impressive first half. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Oh, this is looking promising. So, the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. And so... So, the ball moving again. The pendulum having already swung Belgium's way. Will it be more of the same from them in the second half? Lukaku well the supporters think it's on and the defender coming out on top against Lukaku well the counter chance looks very real Witzel De Bruyne 
Can he take advantage? Just cleared away in the nick of time. Well, the goalkeeper dealt with it admirably. Daly Blint. Steven Bergwijn. Into the advanced position. He'll take this on. Oh, yes! He's going to be proud of that moment. What purity of strike. Caught it absolutely perfectly. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Tielemans went in strongly to win the ball. And foul it is then. So making the substitution now. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? De Bruyne. On to Lukaku. Now with Castagna. It needs an accurate cross. And he did what he had to do defensively. Shot attempted. Well, tremendous block. Well, potentially a chance for Belgium to extend their advantage from this corner. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. And a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Not messing around with that clearance. And now here's Aiden Azar. And making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Really good block. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. Oh, good save. Excellent header. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Not all that convincing defensively. Witzel. Well, body in the way. What a vital intervention. Well, as you can hear, the fans think that should have been a penalty. But I'm not convinced. A deft clearance. Frankie de Jong. Here's Berghaus. And a tidy tackle. And Belgium moving the ball with purpose. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Into the final 20 minutes. A danger here as he runs at them. It'll be a corner. It's a short one. Depay. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Trossard. The Netherlands recovering possession well. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. And given away. Sustained pressure, and now they have the ball. Berghaus. 
Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. He's in with a chance. Palmed away by the keeper. And the flag does go up offside. And they will make the change now. Carrasco. Throw into Belgium then. Lukaku. Can he find the net? A really good stop at the critical stage. Well, had that gone in, there was no way back. Not much time left now, though. Who's going to get on the end of it? Good bit of pressing. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. And so into the final five minutes. On the attack in the closing phase. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. Castagna. Well, that'll be a free kick. Well, very effective play in possession. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. An incisive pass. How about this for drama? All even once more. Astonishing. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. And there's the whistle. They can't be separated after 90 minutes. De Bruyne. Well, the ball rolling again here. The first period of extra time. And you've got to wonder to what extent fatigue will play a part in this now. It's been an extremely competitive 90 minutes. And he stopped them in their tracks. Well, this is a really good game of football. Both sides have played well going forward. There's been plenty of chances, goals and a lot of near misses. It's been great entertainment. Yes, I mean, they're matching each other, attacking blow for attacking blow. He succeeds in clearing it. Now can they counter clinically? Veghorst just the challenge that was required Lukaku plenty of players waiting in the middle a sloppy pass the pie and teammates around him firing it towards goal oh it's an unbelievable save by Courtois trying to deliver it accurately Keeper did his job to begin with and there is the golden goal one that glitters for them and secures their victory Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish.